Well, one thing which uh, uh, one I think must do uh, if, uh, if you want to really find out what's going on is to switch off your TV and stop reading the newspapers for a little while. Because, <laughs> particularly about politics, uh, because, I mean, they're full of something which I would just call hysteria. <laughs> is anybody who is a journalist here? <laughs> Don't want to offend anybody or studying for journalism. But media operates around the 24 uh, hour cycle. If it doesn't operate around the 24 hour cycle, it loses its audience. So it has to pump up the very euphoric, hysteric, and uh, uh, scandalous uh, um, rhythm, which basically keeps the stories being sold. <laughs> it does that to the private life of celebrities. It does that to you know um, the life in Hollywood or, or wherever. But it also does that to, to, to politics, and very much similar like it does it to football. Uh, so if we want to sort of realize or try to have our own interpretation of what's going on, we have to leave media aside and uh, all the emotions which propagate through it because media is extremely powerful in, in, in its ability to propagate. 